right, so we've actually just listened to Dennis Burke at our forum this morning talking about business brokerage, and uh, we're going to talk to a few people, see what they thought about it. Let's uh, get your name first. Uh, Kevin Baylor. Kevin, uh, what do you do for business? Uh, managing partner of Suncoast Business Technologies. We're an IT consulting firm. So uh, what did you think of the presentation this morning? Had you ever heard of business brokers before? Yeah, we've obviously heard of business brokers. Uh, Dennis did a well job uh, presenting himself and presenting the business and talking about the industry as a whole. Okay, so let's say uh, you may not be necessarily in the market right now to either buy a new business or uh, sell yours, but if you were, do you think you would end up using Dennis's services? Yeah, Dennis uh, came across as a well-presented individual. Um, sounds like he knows what he's doing. And I mean, every business owner has to have an exit strategy. So if the, not enough zeros on the check, I mean, uh, you're looking for the next little guy to buy. So. What's your name, sir, and what's your business? Hi, I'm Anthony Houston, CPA. All right, so Anthony, uh, you listened to Dennis this morning. What did you think of the presentation? Uh, and what do you think of business brokerage in general? He was spot on. Business brokerage is very special. I wouldn't buy a business or sell a business without one I, that's kind of silly and the other areas that he touched on briefly was you you have to have the lawyer involved and your CPA involved and very important now I remember you telling me that as a CPA you've moved around a couple of times and uh, obviously trying to find new locations and you know maybe even having to uh, sell your business from your previous state and buy one here if you do that if you were to do that again would you uh, recommend Dennis? Do you think you'd be comfortable with him? Dennis is a good broker. He has the experience to handle your the sale of your business. What's interesting is it's one of the times in your life you don't want to do it by yourself. It's not something you want to handle because you could lose a substantial amount of money without using someone like Dennis. He's, he's excellent. All right, so we're back, and uh, we're going to talk to another individual that was uh, inside the Dennis Burke Forum this morning. Uh, What's your name, sir, and what is uh, what is that you do for a living? Uh, my name is Matt Foy, and I own uh, A to Z Professional Inspections. I'm a home inspector. All right, so you listened to Dennis's presentation this morning. Now, uh, did you learn something new about business brokerage that maybe you had not uh, had not understood before? Yes, I did. I didn't know that uh, that you need a real estate license. I thought maybe the broker, a business broker, had their own type license, and I've learned that today. So. And it's in an industry that I would probably be interested in as I get a little older. So you say you do inspections now. I'm going to guess you're probably not going to do that forever. So uh, if you're going to transition into another business, do you think you would be comfortable uh, using Dennis Burke as your business broker? Um, yes, I talked with ben Dennis about this. I used to be in the construction trade. And since I was born and raised around here, I know most of the people that are in the construction trade. Uh, a lot of them are getting the age where they're looking to sell. That, so that's an industry that I would be very comfortable in to helping him sell. All right, so uh, continuing on with our interviews out here, uh, let me ask you your name. What do you do for a living? Uh, my name is Kenny Van Streeter, and I own a Fun Factory Promotional Products Company. All right, so you got to listen to Dennis this morning for the first time at our forum, and what did you think of his presentation? Uh, did you learn anything this morning that maybe you didn't know before? Uh, I thought there was a bunch of good information there this morning. He seems very, very knowledgeable, and he seems like he has the best interest of business partners in, in his repertoire. Now, if you were to some reason need to buy a business, or maybe even sell the business that you are right now because, you know, maybe it's time to retire, you know, we're obviously in Florida already, but uh, would you actually trust Dennis to either help you buy a new business or sell the one that you currently have? Well, I think that one of the things Dennis offered that made me think was how to value your business. If you price it too high, no one ever buys it. If you price it too low, you've cheated yourself. But involving a professional broker sure seemed like it would be an advantage. Now, did you realize that you needed to have a real estate license to be a business broker? No, I did not. And that was another fact that I thought was very interesting. As people continue to stream out of the meeting, uh, we have Bill here to uh, talk with us. Bill, tell us who you are, what you do, and uh, what did you think of uh, this morning's uh, presentation? I'm Bill Hogan with Hogan Insurance Services here in Bradenton. Um, this morning's meeting was very informative for me because I didn't know anything about this type of business. And really you'd think, okay, well, it's just a realtor, but it's not. There's so much more to it, and it, the requirements that are needed to make sure that it's done correctly was impressive. 
when you say a realtor, did you realize that he actually had to go take the same real estate exam that everybody else that sells uh, residential and commercial buildings do? No, um, I, thought, I thought that was interesting. I mean, I understand that they, you know, he needs some sort of a licensure, but I thought it was like a business broker's license. I had no idea what that would even be. So it's great that he's got a, a wealth of knowledge from the real estate standpoint and the business broker standpoint. So it'd be tremendously helpful for anybody that's either buying or selling a business. Now, how long have you been in the insurance industry? 25 years. In that 25 years, you probably had to uh, pack up shop once, you know, maybe move across town or something like that. So if you had to do it all over again, either buying or selling, uh, do you think you'd be comfortable using Dennis as your business broker? Yes. Um, that's kind of the interesting part is, like he was mentioning in the, in the presentation, how do you value your business? Um, I think a lot of folks are that way. It's like, I'm killing myself but I don't have anything to show for it. I don't know what I, I can show for it. So it's, it's a tremendous help just from that standpoint alone is great. So yes, I would definitely use them.